back again at the crowded bell. You. Okay. This is punishment no, for getting funny. the name I, I, wrong I should, I should, of I, the location. Uh, Keep going, should, should I not say Crowded Barrel? Keep or? going. You can say whatever the hell you want. Back again at Crowded Barrel Distillery, hanging out with Rex Williams of the Whiskey Tribe and, of course, Alan Paletti of the Magic Minute. Alan, what are we doing this time? Oh, well, I need Rex's help for this. I want you to think of some deep, dark secret you don't want shared with the world. <laughs> yeah, but as the cameras roll, <laughs> that's a great time. Best time to do it. How about a deep dark secret that I really don't mind sharing with the world? That's fine. That sure. I think the world that's all should know. know. Okay. Okay. That's all I want to know though. Okay. Okay. Got it. So I want you to write that down there. Don't let me see. Okay. I'm going to turn my head. Okay. okay. Right. This is like writing a secret uh, press release or a secret tweet. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Whenever you got it done, Rex, so go ahead and you could show everybody except oh, for me, of course. Okay. All right. Okay. Not you though. Oh, oh no. Yeah. All right. All right. Okay. And then when you've done that, you can go ahead and fold that all the way back up. Okay. I'll take that, and we're actually going to do another little piece here because I want to rip this up into shreds. Sure. So there's no way I can. I'm, I'm it. locking okay. eyes. Right. It's right there. No way I can know what that is. Right. Yes. Yes. Yeah, you're tearing it. Yes. Super yes. Super tearing it. I'm trying to super tear it, not even looking. Okay. Don't judge me. <laughs> <laughs> it's not a phone book. <laughs> <laughs> take the piece and squeeze them tight. Yeah. Okay. And then I'm going to try to read your mind. Okay. Think about what you want. What you're thinking about. Uh, as deep as you can. Yeah, okay. I'm trying not to think about okay. it, but this is harder than it than it usually is. Yeah. I'm, not, I'm not sure what's going on, right? I'm, it, my mind defenses are strong. <laughs> oh, mind <geez>. defenses. Uh, <laughs> mind defenses are very strong. <laughs> I think I, I think I got this. I think I got this. Yes. Um, what you were thinking of was that Brian smells like hot dog water. <laughs> f you, f you. Let's toast. toast. <laughs> you got it, by the way. All right, how surprising was that? Not that I smell like hot dog water, <laughs> which, by the way, I totally don't. Here's the thing maybe there is magic involved, but you sitting there and him sitting here. I think anybody could have guessed. God damn it. That you could smell. You, you smelled <laughs> the hot dog that's water. That's the method. Is that you smelled the hot dog water. Yeah, it was impressive. You're like, you tore it up, I'm holding the thing, and then magic happens somehow. Yes. Right. Yeah. Do, do you have any guess as to how he divined it? Uh, I'm thinking probably palmed some paper as he was tearing and then handed me the torn up stuff. So it was the, it was the handoff, whenever I handed you the note, that got palmed, you tore up something else and handed it to me. Because I never checked the tore up stuff. And when you looked away... Okay, so yes, uh, you're, you're close, but let me show you. Uh, what I want to do, of course, is I want to put creases in those. I use a three by five card and then I cut it in half. And then I have a folded piece. That's so that way people know to fold it up afterwards. Yeah. That's a very clever way to intimate that that's the natural thing they should do to hide it, is to fold it up into the quarters. Yeah, it kind of gives them, oh, that's the right, that's right. what I'm supposed to do. Right. right? Kind of built in. Um, I also draw a circle in it. That way the information doesn't really leave the circle. And so I know whenever I tear it up later, I'll be able to get the information. I okay. have seen some other people have suggested doing things like, uh, I want you to imagine you're seeing this secret on television. So they'll draw a picture of a television on there. Mm -hmm. So uh, that way it's a, there's a little bit of storytelling context to give a reason why it's in the middle. Yeah, okay. So you write down, uh, Brian smells like hot dog water or whatever you'd like. There, now I fold it up. Okay, so I've got my vision averted. So I take it back, I turn around. Yeah. And then uh, the way you tear this is really important. Without it, you're just gonna rip up. So there's a so, tear technique. So at this point, you've got the information in the centermost part of right. the thing, which is, I assume, why they call it a center tear. Center tear. Yeah. I'm left-handed, so I always have the... Oh, so you, you hold all four flaps on the one side. Yes. Okay. Yeah. And then what? And then I'm going to tear, but I'm not going to tear uh, very much. I'm gonna tear about a third. Oh. Just straight vertically down. Oh, that's interesting because I would have the impulse to immediately tear out the circle yeah, you can at do the that beginning. Too. You can do that too. That's oh, you a variation. Can. Yeah. Okay, because then it just looks like I tore off a bit of it and then I'm continuing to tear equal sizes and it looks like I have four roughly equal sections. Mm -hmm. And then, but how do you palm off that bit at so, the end? Uh, so, you know, I, I, what I do is I do it a couple tears there. I do another tear this way. But you're keeping track of where the information block is. Yeah, and it's really easy to do because that folded corner is always in my hand, uh, right? Okay. It's always closest to my right hand. So I give all of these pieces yeah. to you. Sure. Okay. And then the stuff that actually has the secret all in All the there, information. That's in your hand. Is right here. And that's just in a simple finger palm or whatever. So it, it, yeah. you have a lot of leeway to maneuver everything around. You get this into a finger palm and then you, you just hand them all the garbage. Yep. For them to hold on to. Yeah. Now it's not ideal. If they do look through the pieces, they're going to notice that it's 
pencil marks aren't there. Right. Um, so the ideal way to do it is to burn it like in an ashtray or throw it pieces away so that there's no way to have access to it. Oh, after. and if you do that, now you've given them a process. You're like, okay, this is your thoughts, your secrets. I want to make sure nobody else knows it. Right. Let's burn these. Do you have a, a lighter on you? So now they're grabbing stuff. They're setting it in an ashtray. They're like, go ahead and light it, burn it. So the whole time you're down here just like, do, 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 reading all this stuff. Like, do you even need to be subtle? Because if they have a job. Then you don't really, you can just walk away and just let me know when you're done and you're just sitting here reading it. And, and, <laughs> and you you didn't see him peeking at it at all? No, what was my job while you were peeking? What was I supposed to do? You were holding onto that and I was doing this. Okay. He was doing the classic mentalism, the, I, I have a migraine uh, pose. And I'm just looking down at my right hand below the table. Okay, pondering the secrets. Yes, exactly. Yeah. All right, I can ponder. Just so I'm, all you're doing is thinking about what you wrote down. Okay, just ponder super good. All right, <laughs> all right, let's see, let's see your wizardry then. Paper me, Brian. <laughs> Brian, are you ready for the magics? Yes, I'm ready for magic. I'm gonna put in a magic circle. Okay. Okay, this is the circle that is bringing all the magics onto this paper. I like that you're at least attempting to have a reason for the circle, that's good. Yes, now, I want you to put on this magic circle your most deep, dark, embarrassing, cringy secret. Okay. Not, a, not about me. Okay. Not about me. And I'm looking away so you can have full effect of the paper magics. It's a very detailed oh, secret. Oh, so it feels like payback to me is what it feels like. So concerned right now. All right, all right, I got it. Okay. Right. So what, should I fold it up so you can't see it? Fold it up so I can't see it. All right, all right, yeah, no, here it is. It's right here in front okay, of you. You're right. touching now, it. This is the deepest, darkest, darkest secret that oh you don't want anywhere Oh my gosh, I'm so embarrassed if internet. anybody knew. Okay, that, would be, that would be really brutal. I'm gonna tear this up. Oh, okay, right? I'm why gonna, are you doing I'm that? I'm putting it in your head. What? So the magic's... You should always have a more nested Take narrative than this. Okay, now, I, I can imagine, imagine, I can imagine what's Sh in there. Sh should I hold it? I'm gonna hold it. Hold I'm just that. gonna assume I'm supposed to hold it. You hold that. Because I'm not giving correct... My secret was so much better than your secret. But you know what the, your secret is? What? HDW99 available at scamstuff.com. Oh my God, how did you find out about my secret cologne? HDW99, <laughs> hot dog water 99 available at scamstuff.com. Dude, I will buy that hot dog. <laughs>